This first up tonight, CMPD calling on the community to help cut down on violent crimes involving young people. That includes calling on school teachers who are often front and center with these kids. CMS addressing these school safety plans today during its mid year review in WCNC Charlotte's Jane Monrell is joining us live from CMS headquarters to talk about this discussion that the district had. Hey, Jane. Hey, Vanessa and Fred. Yeah, it's halfway through the school year now, and so far two guns have been found on CMS campuses. That was last year. While that's too, too many, it's 20 less than from the same time the year before. And school leaders say it's not without effort. District officials say a gun found at West Mech High School last month was discovered because of body scanners. It was the second gun found at a CMS school this school year, a dramatic improvement from the year before. I don't want to say it's 100 percent attributed. There's some other things that we put in place, like the reestablishment of the Campus Crime Stoppers program. Um, uh, and I, I think certain things, the deterrence uh, of that, as well as some of the educational pieces to the parents. CMPD Chief Johnny Jennings calling on the community, including parents and schools, to help keep guns out of the hands of kids. CMS Chief Operating Officer Brian Schultz says they're continuing to collaborate with law enforcement. Absolutely, the intervention is the, one of the most extremes we've, extreme that we've ever implemented in the district. So that plays a major part in it. To say it's 100 percent, I can't say 100 percent. We've also done some additional things. The district working on a badge and camera system for identification, as well as staff training in areas like active survival training. I hate that we're at a place where we have to have those uh, in our schools, but that's the place that we are in because the, the threat's coming from outside of the schools. He says at the end of the day, school safety goes hand in hand with student learning. 20 fewer students that were suspended. Well, it's an automatic 365 days you're out of school. So that's 7,300 days of school for just those students. But then we have reduction in other weapons um, this year. And so those are the fewer students being suspended as a result of that. Well, as of right now, 68 out of CMS's 178 schools have body scanners installed. Live at CMS headquarters in Charlotte, Jane Monreal, WCNC Charlotte. Jane, thank you.